Hello everybody, welcome to Being Civil. In this video, we will calculate the tensile strength of single angle 1998 which is connected to a 10 mm gasser with the help of 3 F20 bolts. In the previous video, we have discussed the theory of design of tension members as per section 6 of IS 800-2007. So let's check the video first and come into this video. So let's start. The first check you have to calculate is the design strength due to yielding of gross section. The formula is TDG AG FY by gamma M0. AG is the cross section area of this angle which is 1998 here. To find out the AG of 1998 you have to go to SP6 1964. The rule still equal angles. In page 10 you see this is IASA 1998 here the thickness is 8 and the sectional area is 13.79 cm square. 13.79 cm square means 1379 millimeter square into 250 which is Newton per millimeter square. So we get this in Newton 10 to the power minus 3 for kilo Newton. So 313.41 kN is the design strength due to yielding. Now coming to point number 2 which is design strength due to rupture. If you see this cross section it will be like this. This is the gusset. This is the angle 1998 connected by M20 volts. The formula of rupture is for single angle. A and C is the net area of the connected leg. Connected leg means this leg. And this is outstand leg. So what is the net area? The total area is 1379. So this connected leg length is 1379 by 2. Then you have to subtract this area. For M20 volts, the diameter of holes is 22. And this thickness is 8. So this area is 22 into 8. five one three point five. HU is the cross area of the outstand leg. Means this one. 689.5. Now we have to calculate the beta. The formula beta is What is W? W is nothing but the leg length which is 90 here. T is thickness 8. BS. BS is W plus WL minus T. WL is this distance means this one which is 50. So 90 plus 50 minus 8. You get 132. LC is the distance between outermost poles means the first volt and the last volt which is 60 plus 60 here so 120 if this 50 distance that is the gauge distance of bolts is not given in the question then you can find out from this table of sp61 from page 168 it is the gauge distance in lake of angles you see here for 90 the gauge distance is 50 so now calculate the beta value point eight two six. you must check if this is less than equal to this and greater than equal to this so it is greater than equal greater than 0.7 so okay so let's calculate this calculate this if you gamma m0 if you is 4 1 into gamma m0 is 1.1 into 0.9 by fy 250 gamma m1 1.25 so this is 1.29 so okay we got the beta is 0.826 so calculate tdn now
281.02 kN. This is the design strength due to rupture. So number 3 is block shear. This section may fail by this line. So after failure, the section will be like this. This is 50, this is so 40, notice this distance, this is 40, 60, 60, so this is 160. The formula block shear is TdB1 equals to and TdB2 is So you have to calculate the AVG, ATN, AVN and ATG. AVG gross area of this section V means along the force. So this portion. So this length is 160 and the thickness is 8. So this is the AVG. So what is AVN along same direction the net area. So 1280 minus you have to subtract this area this distance is all 22 and thickness is 8 and there is 1 2 2 full and 1 is half so total 2.5 into 22 into 8 this is the thickness so calculate it 840 millimeters square now ATG ATG is a perpendicular to force that means this line so a T gross area the length is 40 so 40 into 8 is 320 ATN is the net area which is 320 minus there is a half of this whole so 0.5 into 22 into 8 232 put these values in this equation So you get TdB1 is 236.44 and uh, TdB2 is 215.89 kN. So the design strain due to block shear TdB will be minimum of these two. So this is 215.89 kN. And we have got that uh, yielding is 313.41. In the rupture we have got 281.02 and the block shear we got 215.89. So the tensile strength will be minimum of these three which is 215.89 kN. This is the final capacity of single angle 1998 connected by three bolts m20 bolts to a 10 millimeter thick gusset hope you like this video give it a thumbs up stay subscribed to my channel see you in the next video